How you doing, YouTube? It's Willful the Development. It's my 298th? 398th. I think it's 298, right? It's gotta be, right? Right? 298? I don't know. My phone's on the charger. I can't grab it. So, either way, the title should be correct, at least. So, we're a couple weeks late, right? Um, fun stories. So, two weeks ago, Monday goes great. Tuesday goes great. Wednesday goes great, especially because it's a rest day. Thursday goes great. Except it doesn't. Right up until training, uh, doing some circus dumbbell work, which honestly I'm surprised how well it's gone, when it's gone well. Like tonight it went well, except for the terrible bruising it gives you on the forearm there. Hey, look at that vein there. That's fun. Anyway, uh... get the warm-ups done, I hit one good rep, and it's like I can't breathe. All of a sudden, bo my body starts hurting, like, just everywhere <laughs> starts hurting, and I'm like, this is weird. No sniffles, nothing like that, no headaches. I'm just like, what the hell's going on, you know? Try to have a good session, and then I eventually I just quit. I just say, I'm done. This is not, this is not working. I'm just gonna head home. Driving home, and I'm just like, oh my god. My back hurts. Everything hurts so much. All of my muscles and joints just start hurting instantly. I just out of nowhere. I'm like, this ain't good. Get home and I'm just sitting there on the couch because I can't really move. And I'm just, I'm just like, man, I feel dizzy. And I feel hot. Yeah, it turns out I had a fever. I was at like 101. <sighs> Which like just a couple degrees, you you know you'll feel that in your body. It sucks, and I'm like, oh man, this isn't good, you know. As like it's fine, Friday I'll just sleep it off, and of course everything was just saying no, you're not allowed to sleep today. Have Amazon package deliveries almost every day. They never knock. Had three show up that day, um, and all three of them knocked. So, couldn't really sweat it out like I planned. I did a little bit. Had chills, body aches, all of it, right? I'm like, ah. You know what? I'm still going to get on this plane. Still going to try to enjoy the long weekend. Let's just do it. Um, I'm okay when I get there. Uh, the body aches finally go away around Saturday. But then sore throat hits on Sunday. The mucus starts on Sunday. But I still feel okay. Now that the body aches are done, I'm like, I'm good, bro. I can, I can do this all day. I go, get on the plane Monday to get home, and uh, I've always had trouble with my right ear popping after getting on a plane, and uh, this is the absolute worst it has ever been, ever. Uh, I'm just assuming because there's so much stuff backed up in the sinuses, the ear doesn't pop. Well, then it gets to the point where basically neither ear is popping. Finally, the left one did uh, after a couple hours of being on the ground on Monday. But that right ear just would not pop. To, to this day, it's finally starting to actually get some movement uh, yesterday. And today have been the best, two best days since. This is last Monday, by the way. Um, I'm like, that's fine. It's a deload week this week anyway. This is last week. Because we have the comp coming up on Saturday. And um, I'm just going to do a whole separate video on that comp. Uh, just doing a recap of it. I'll say I came second place out of five. Um, that's all I'm going to say about that comp right now. Uh, yeah, so I train Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, and I planned on going in on Friday. But around, I don't know, noonish, maybe 11, I eat something. I think it was beef. And I remember while I'm eating it, I'm like, this doesn't quite taste right. This tastes almost fermented. And I kind of remembered afterward, like, oh, shit, I think that stayed out all night. And then got put in the fridge this morning. I'm sure it's fine. It doesn't taste fine. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, it probably isn't good. So then I have a second bowl a couple hours later. Because I'm just, I'm that stupid sometimes. And uh, by 4.30, I'm on the couch. I can barely move. Because every time I'm like, ah, you'll be fine. Tough it up. And then 
I get up and I go, oh no, you know, it's just awful, awful. Uh, finally, I it was able to uh, purge it from the system. And when that happened, I felt great, like immediately after. I was like, cool, okay, let's go compete tomorrow. And I sounded kind of like this. And the whole competition, I'm just, mucus coming out. It feels like I've got just, my lungs are just filled with fluid is what it feels like. I remember on the first event, it was a yoke into a log, and I, my plan was to viper the log, but every time I went down and held my breath to brace and roll the log up, I got to hear and felt like I was going to throw up, because when I put my head up, all the drainage went right down my throat, and so I'm sitting there, and I'm like, if you try to dip, you're probably just going to throw up. So I'm just stricting every rep. Yeah, it was a, it was a tough day get through that and then now we're on to this week and uh boy monday was tough and uh tuesday was a little better um a lot of the mucus got out yesterday and especially this morning um a lot of the <laughs> fluid is finally getting out of me finally draining and feeling a little bit better body body aches totally gone no more sore throat it's just all this stuff getting out of me now. Um, and I've just been trying to take a bunch of vitamin C and stuff like that. Um, fun fact, vitamin C in studies shows that it does not prevent sicknesses, but it will help you get over them faster. Um, load up on it. It's, you know, it's water soluble, so it won't hurt you. Um, your body might not absorb it as well if you take like just a thousand in the morning and think that's enough. Just take a thousand in the morning, a thousand in the evening or afternoon, and then a thousand more in the evening, you know, give your body as much chance as it can. Or mix up a thousand and sip on it throughout the day. Um, maybe go through two bottles of it in a day, that kind of thing. That might work pretty well. Um, but yeah, so that's kind of what I've been doing just every time I eat, I've just been taking some vitamin C and honestly I think it is helping I think it is making me feel a lot better um, maybe it's even helping break some of this stuff up um, but you know training uh, training this week has actually been pretty okay um, especially on circus dumbbell tonight um, which I really needed that win because the last session I had two weeks ago was just not good um, it's just that simple it just was not a good session and it, that was right when the whatever hit me kicked in um, so so it was really nice to have a good session and I hit all the numbers I needed to actually did miss a rep came back about a minute two minutes later and pff, it was the easiest one I did all night um, it just be like that sometimes so so yeah uh, next week should be a normal week and the week after that is actually gonna be nationals which I'll be getting on a plane on Thursday and I intend to do an update just on the phone. This is two weeks from now, so I've got some time. So yeah, um, you know, I've missed two weeks, but uh, honestly not a ton to report, uh, just because I've just been under the weather. So um, I have, what, three competition recaps to do and footage to upload, so I'll get on those. Uh, I should have some time this weekend, and I feel pretty motivated to actually put them up and and talk about them and shoot some videos about them. Um, so look forward to those and uh, look forward to next week which should be a really good week of training. Um, after this week anything has to be. Uh, even, God, I even missed dead deadlifts I should not have missed yesterday. Um, that's That was upsetting. Uh, haven't missed deadlifts that I was supposed to be able to hit in a, in a very long time. Probably about five months, give or take. Uh, so that, you know, it was good to have a good session today. I'll, I'll just say that. Uh, so, yeah. Um, don't get on a plane if you're feeling even sick. Uh, and the only reason I got on the plane, number one, I had to get home. But two, I was already past the point that I was contagious. It was just like the drainage part now. And, uh, man... The headaches I had for like three days straight. Holy crap. Tonight might be the first night I finally get to sleep without a headache uh, while going to bed, which is a, a just a wonderful, wonderful thought. Um, yeah. Uh, I don't know what the lesson is this week. 
these last two weeks. Um, I guess load up on vitamin C when you get sick. If you don't, then what's your excuse?